this video talks about entities and relationship you know relationship means association between many entities for example one employee instance reporting to another employee instance maybe an employee and a contract employee employee and a permanent employee then there are different types of uh, relationship identifying relationship non identifying relationship many to many relationship is of type sub type so we will just have a close look at what is this relationship and how we set this relationship in arvin data modeler tool to explain various relationship especially the identifying and non identifying relationship i have an example to explain you so we have an entity relationship diagram in that i have pulled employee permanent employee and contract employee and external organization so in the case of a identifying relationship the child cannot exist without the parent so whether it is a permanent employee whether it is a contract employee they cannot exist without an employee existence right so let me create a permanent relationship an identifying relationship from employee to the permanent employee and employee to the contract employee so the employee id is a must for becoming permanent employee and contract employee so if you look at this relationship you can identify that the foreign key is the primary key of employee and the pro foreign key also is a primary key of the permanent employee as well as a contract employee so this both entities cannot exist without the employee entity so we have something called data type employee type this employee type will decide what type of employee is it whether it is a permanent employee if permanent employee it will have a salary it will have a band if it is a contract employee it will have hourly rate and contract number but again uh that is identifying relationship but you know the contract employee with respect to them they can be part of any organization external organization and they can they cannot be also so i can i i have say i can say this uh, employee if i look at this there is a uh, primary key for the organization so if i make a non identifying relationship from external organization to the contract what happens now this external organization id becomes a foreign key but never become part of the primary key that means this allows null or not null right so this kind of entity this kind of relationship where um the child can exist without an organization also so that is a non identifying relationship this is an identifying relationship i hope you understand about the difference between the identifying relationship and non identifying relationship and how this is being represented in a er diagram so we have seen identifying relationship and non identifying relationship you know in identifying relationship um, the parent child cannot exist without a parent and non identifying relationship the child can exist without a parent so third type of relationship is many to many relationship in many to many relationship more than one record of one entity can be associated with more than one record in another table and vice versa so in order to uh, explain uh, display the many to many relationship in erwin i have just added two more entities to this diagram roles and users now uh, many roles can be paid by many users and many users and user can take multiple roles so many to many relationship it is very easy to uh, connect Uh, many to many relationship let's go to the menu and just drag the many to many um, connection to on the top of these two tables so basically uh, uh, there are some challenges uh, because of this uh, multiple uh, relationship or association so normally in the database uh, level or physical level what does do is they have introduced a third associated table where we will have 
the primary key of the roles and primary key of the user as the primary key of and the foreign key of the user role user so if you can also bring that into the logical layer for that let's go to the model view we have uh, sorry the actions menu we have the transformation uh, let's just uh, select and we have something called the resolve many to many relationship so if you choose the resolve many to many relationship it will introduce an associated table and you know the similarly what you see for the uh, physical layer uh, the role id the primary key of the roles and the primary key of the user id becomes the foreign key and the combination of the primary key of the role user so that uh, this is properly managed um, with a associated table so this is a, a third type of many to many relationship so we have seen identify relation non identify relation and many to many relation how to represent them in a carbon data model tool thank you